The Gregory Kelser Gymnasium. Man, my uncle must have really been something to see for Henry Ford to name their gym after him. Of course, everyone knows about his days at Michigan State, teaming up with Irvin Magic Johnson. He brought the Spartans their first ever NCAA championship. Now that's how you make history. Walter has always had basketball in his blood, no doubt about it. He's been a regular at my basketball camps since he was four years old. Last year, he led the Wald Lake Central Vikings to their first regional title in 13 years. There's no telling how high his ceiling is. You know, my nephew Walter may not be six feet eight like his uncle, but he certainly measures up to the Kelser name once he steps onto that court. His ambitions fit right in. We're all cheering for you now. We're all watching you carry on that legacy. Uh, I hope that doesn't put pressure on you. No pressure. <laughs> you better not miss, because if you do, I got a couple of shots that'll put you away. That's what I needed. That's what I needed. When I used to have you at the camps, did you think I was extra hard on you? Extra hard. <laughs> <laughs> and I always used to get in trouble a lot. <laughs> I remember that. I started at like five. That's right. <laughs> learning, learning just the basics of the, of the game. I went on almost every camp. And now, like, sometimes if I go to the camp, I'd be a coach and try to teach the young kids what I, what I got taught when I was a young age. Stay aggressive. You ever heard of Urban Magic Johnson? Yeah. What do you know about him? <laughs> Who do you pattern your game after? I look at Damian Lillard a lot. Ah. A lot of people doubt him. And I think in high school basketball right now, a lot of people doubt me. Uh, a lot of people say, you know, he's 5'10". If he was uh, taller, they would be a, a high D1 prospect. I don't think size matters to me. That's why I go out and I play hard regarding the size. That's what I like to hear. That's what I like to hear. Because you cannot control how tall you are. But you can control how, how big and how tall your heart is. All right. Very nice. When you're out there on that floor, you never know who's watching. You never know who's there. That's why it's always critical that you go out and play as well, play as hard as you possibly can. You're not going to play great all the time because you're not going to make every shot. But you can play hard every single game. You can control that. You're part of a legacy, you know, and one of which I'm very proud. And you're following in those footsteps. Uh, does that give you a sense of pride? It definitely inspires me as you play against the greatest and just to know that you uh, you competed with them and you didn't look at them as the, as the greatest. You wanted to be great and so you wanted them to look at you like you were the greatest. So, That's right. Um, I think that rubs off on me a lot. Um, it's, it's a lot of uh, a lot of great players in Michigan right now. And, you know, every time I go against them, I feel like that's a chance for me to prove a point. I need three in a row. As if you were fouled on a uh, three-point shot. I just wanna have the same career as you guys had. <laughs> Play the same way. Uh, hopefully I get the same height. <laughs> One day. I declare you ready.